just, you know, pulling shit like this again. But I'm a preppy, happy, idealist paragon person, so... You can go, but this isn't over. I'll find you eventually. Maybe, but I made sure you won't follow me today. Those charges are still on the timer. Better hurry if you want to save your friends. Dead and done. Just the way I like them. So I'm assuming that we'll be able to catch him another day, therefore we can get him and save these hostages, and thus everything will be okay. I will, however, point out that this is the least sporting surrender in the history of the world, because he's still sending shit after us, and that's not really in the spirit of things, is it? There we go, that's one charge down. Rely on you guys to just sort of busy for me. Because I'm busy saving the world. By the world, I mean this room. Uh, pardon me. Uh, let's see if I can help out here. Von down. There we go. Just one more to go. Not quite sure where it is. Let's check. Okay, so it's... It's around this way. Garrus, get your shields back. Rex, you just be a mortal. There we go. I guess I'm going entirely the wrong way. Yep, so it would be. But now I'm going the right way, so it's fine. It's just a slightly longer way, but I still have time. What is going on? What are you guys even shooting at? There we go. And finally... All the other... Letting him go was better than the alternative. I thought you were going to stay someplace safe. I... There might have been something I could have done to help. I thought I should be here. I know this asteroid better than anyone. You did it. Another hour and our course would have been irreversible. I ran the numbers, Shepard. X-57 would have struck near the capital city. The most densely populated region. But that's not going to happen, thanks to you. Is Katie in here? Is she alright? Is her team? Balak was holding them hostage. I let him go to save them. Let a terrorist go or sacrifice innocent lives. I'm glad that's not a choice I had to make. Is that... Will you get in trouble for that? I mean, he could do the same thing somewhere else, couldn't he? Yeah, he could. Balak seemed like a practical man. Practical, but callous. I'm sure if he'd been in my place, Miss Bowman would be dead now along with all the terrorists. But I'm not going to sacrifice people who happen to be between me and my target. So what happens now? The bad guys get away? Balak gets away today, but we'll still be after him tomorrow and the day after that. Me, my crew, and every other crew in the Alliance. He'll run and he'll hide, but eventually he'll slip up and we'll get him. Bad guys never get away, Simon. Not unless the good guys give up. Well, I wouldn't want you after me. Shepard, thank you for my grandchildren's lives. I don't think I'll stick around, though. Not with the team gone. Too many ghosts. It's time for me to get back and spend some time with my family. Before I go, I'd like to offer you something. Maybe you'll have more use for it than I will. As lead engineer, I get some quality items. Take your pick. You've earned it. I know it's a lot to ask, but that Omni tool of yours? I could really use something like that. Shepard. I think I mentioned that you saved my kids and grandkids. What's an Omni-Tool compared to that? You take it, with my blessing. I hope you get good use out of it. One more thing. You asked me to look into your missing engineers. Have you found them? Yes, all of them. Their bodies, anyway. Oh. I... I see. Well then, I guess it's better than not knowing. Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. We owe you. 
Yay! So let's go check on the hostages, make sure they're okay. Two Paragon points! Hang on a second. Well, I must have gotten more earlier, because that's buttoning right to the top, but I was going to say, letting him go and he nets me two points, that's, that's not what I'm all about. I can't believe you let Balak go. To save us. I half expected you to just let us die. Sacrifice the few for the many. Well, it was technically the better choice if this were real, but since it's happy idealist fiction, well, it's not actually happy idealist fiction, Mass Effect gets pretty grim, but this particular bit is feeling pretty ideal, except for the death and heart. Look, it's not my way, okay? Then I'd be no better than the Batarians. Besides, Balak won't get away with this. I know who he is now. He can't run forever. <laughs> you sound like my brother. He was always so stubborn, but always willing to do the right thing, no matter what. Your brother was the one Balak killed? Yes. Aaron. He was the one who convinced me to join the team here. Said it would be an adventure. I, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but I should see to Aaron. I understand. You've been through enough today. I'll get out of your way. Thank you. Oh, I don't even know your name. Shepard. Commander Shepard. Thank you, Commander Shepard. You're not exactly what I expected, but thank you. So I know you want to attend for your brother, but I've got questions! Woo! What can you tell me about the Batarians? What were they hoping to achieve with all this? I don't even think they knew. When they first arrived, they were talking about getting us back to their ship wanted to sell us as slaves. When Balak showed up, everything changed. It was his idea to redirect the asteroid. Said it was the will of the Batarian Rebellion, whatever that is. They followed him quickly enough, but I, I don't know. I don't think they're all as fanatical as he was. That was a brave thing you did, Kate. Contacting me on the radio, risking your life. Stubborn and determined runs in the family. My father was in the Alliance back on Earth. I think he was disappointed none of his kids signed up, but he'd be proud of Aaron. Sorry. I just... How did the asteroid get all the way over here, and why wasn't someone alerted sooner? The asteroid was scheduled to arrive in a day or two. Balak just sped it up. This rock is full of valuable minerals, but it was too far from Terra Nova to be profitable, so we attached some fusion rockets to it and drove it back. It was all going smoothly until we'll get everything back to normal soon enough. <laughs> Almost everything. You've been through a lot. I'll get out of your way. So long, Kate. I appreciate that, Commander. Goodbye. Excellent. So, that's basically us done with this adventure. We can get off the asteroid and back on the Normandy. And I believe that's me basically done with all the side quests that I wanted to do, which means that now, people, we get to go to Vermeer. So thank you for your patience watching all of these side quests. I know there are quite a lot, especially one big chunk like that, but now everything gets great. I mean, it was all still pretty good, but now it just gets great. So thank you for watching these videos, and I shall see you.